वेलकम टू माई YouTube चैनल साइंस एंड मेडिसन टूडे वी विल लर्न फार्माकोलॉजी ऑफ फाइब्रेट और फेब्रिक एसिड डेरीवेटिव फाइब्रेट और फेब्रिक एसिड डेरीवेटिव आर एंटी हाइपर लिपिडीमिक ड्रग यूज इन अ कंडीशन ऑफ हाइपर लिपिडीमिया वेन बॉडी कोलेस्ट्रॉल और ट्राइग्लेसराइड लेवल इंक्रीजेस सो वी लर्न इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ फाइब्रेट मैकेनिज्म ऑफ एक्शन फार्माकोकाइनेटिक therapeutic use of fibrate adverse effect of these drugs so starting with the introduction fibrate are derivatives of fibric acid they can reduce the level of triglyceride primarily in our body triglyceride contain glycerol and free fatty acid as you know lpl can remove triglyceride from our plasma and break down it into a free fatty acid they can increase the level of hdl good cholesterol also triglyceride come from food and liver so before going towards the mechanism of action of fibrate we must know about ppar alpha ppar alpha is peroxisome proliferated activated receptors ppars these receptors located on a nuclear membrane PPAR alpha found in metabolically active tissues such as liver and adipose tissues receptors are member of nuclear receptor which are activated by ligand fatty acid or anti hyperlipidemic drugs and function as transcription factor so when fibrate can bind to these receptor they are activated mechanism of action of fibrate here a diagram can represent you a clear concept of mechanism of action and location of ppar alpha so ppar alpha is in yellow color which is present on a nuclear membrane which is in blue in color so when fibrate can bind to ppar alpha they can inhibit or activate the certain chain reaction which are involved in a lipid metabolism so it can increases or decrease the different expression so it increase expression of lpl lipoprotein lipase which increase the removal of triglyceride from circulation and break down into fatty acid so when triglyceride level increases in our body lpl can take triglyceride from our plasma and break down into free fatty acid so here lpl lipoprotein lipase is present on endothelial lining of arteries or vascular surfaces so this lpl can take triglyceride from our plasma and break down into free fatty acids also decrease the expression of protein apo c3 which inhibit the lpl actively increases the expression of apo protein a1 and apo protein a2 which are the major components of hdl a good cholesterol in our body therapeutic use of these drugs treatment of hypertriglyceridemia treatment of type 3 hyperlipidemia pharmacokinetic of fibrate they administered orally why they administered orally because well absorbed and well distributed bind to albumin pinofibrate is a drug of fibrate which is in inactive form and when it administered in a body it can convert it into its activated form so pinofibrate is a pro drug and convert into pinofibric acid in our body or pinofibric acid is a active form of pinofibrate they excreted by kidney so excreted in urine as glucuronoid adverse effect of these drugs are common as that of statin so gi disturbance is the most common side effect of these drugs gallstone formation is the adverse adverse effect of these drugs so when you take fibrate gallstone formation can take place myopathy and rhabdo 
myolysis is the same adverse effect as that of statins so contraindication for fibrate is that do not take with the statins or if your kidney is not performing function well so do not take the fibrate thank you